In this video, I will show you how to disassemble and reassemble the toot. First, start by removing the head joint. You will need a dulled flathead screwdriver. Firmly grasp it where the head joint attaches. Use your screwdriver to pop open the joints on either side of the instrument. You may need to give it a few twists to release it. Then use your screwdriver slotting away from you and push the sides open. You may need to wiggle them a little bit to help release the joints. Once you get one side, move to the other and separate the halves as well. Make sure to always point the screwdriver away from you. Once you have separated the bottom part of the instrument, use the screwdriver in all of the open spaces to separate the front of the instrument from the center. Give it a little wiggle to help these parts separate. Once you have separated the center, you can now see how the keys attach. Each key has two openings where it will attach to the inside of the body. The thicker part of the key goes on the outside. To place a new key, simply insert and press firmly on the two joints to help it attach. Check to make sure that all keys are firmly attached before putting the toot back together. You can also replace the thumb key in the same way. When you are ready to reassemble, make sure that the keys line up with the openings for the inside of the body. Press firmly and you will hear clicks on either side of the instrument as the middle attaches to the front. When you reattach the back, make sure that the thumb key lines up with the opening. Firmly press and both sides of the instrument will click together. You will hear clicks on both sides of the instrument. Check to make sure that both sides of the body are firmly connected and that the seam is flush. Reattach the head joint. You have now reassembled your toot.